Hey Sagittarius, I hope y'all are doing well. This is going to be uh, a general reading for the current energy to the end of July. Any information you need, you can find it in the description box down below. Um, I do have personals open for the time being. Everything's down there for anybody who's interested in booking before those close, okay? Let's see what we have here for you. Okay. Some of you have felt blindsided in a situation recently, okay? Um, or if it wasn't recently, it could just still feel very fresh to you. Uh, there was something you were working towards and you feel like it was taken out from under you, like a dream was taken or your feelings were taken advantage of, like somebody took your energy knowing they weren't going to give anything back. Something like that happened here. Could have been with a water sign or an air sign. Let me see what else we have here, Sagittarius. Oh my goodness. Wow. Some of you, the lovers showing up, you've been trying to align yourself with something much better though. I feel like you have gotten in a space of, how do I describe the energy there? Some of you have just felt too exhausted to even try to manifest anything new, you know? Some of you have just completely lost hope and that's changing. That's turning around here. You move from the five of pentacles to the six of pentacles, okay? So that's progress. You know, you go from feeling this energy of lack to, you know what, I'm going to plant seeds. I'm going to do better for myself. You know, something is changing for you. You have the lovers. That's a significant turning point. I feel for a lot of you, there's going to be a turning point in your love life mostly, but also in your finances. Let's see what else we have. Yeah, there is very good news coming in for you. The star is like a wish fulfillment, a dream like coming true. You know, this is something that's going to manifest in the physical and you're going to be like, wow, where did that come from with the seven of cups energy? Um, you know, because that could be confusion. And the nine of pentacles is like financial independence, freedom, feeling good about yourself. Some of you could have Venus and Virgo. Let me see what else we have here. Temperance, Sagittarius energy. It's because you've healed from this, okay? I feel like you took the time. Like, it's just that simple. You took the time to heal from this heartbroken energy. Uh, you got out of this space of lack. Like, you pulled yourself up, and you're starting something new. And more importantly, you're believing that you can achieve this. And I feel like that's what's allowing things to truly turn around for you. You're not sitting there going, I hope this happens, but I know that it won't, you know? Like, you're not doing that. You're actually believing that it can, and you're taking steps towards it to prove that you believe that. Queen of Pentacles, ultimate stability, even though it's taken a while. And some of you, you want to end up with a Capricorn, a Virgo, or a Pisces is something else that I'm seeing here. Um, I feel like it could be a little while out. I see you mostly focusing on your coins here, but this connection is still going to develop very soon. You know, I just feel like the the end game aspect of it could be a little bit further out, you know, but you could meet this person in July. That's what I'm seeing here for you. Look at that. King and Queen of Cups, okay? A true pair. Wow. All right, Sagittarius. So I like to see that. This is very good news. Um, I hope that this was helpful or fun. Details are down below for anyone who is interested in personals, Patreon, or Instagram. Everything's down there and available, but if this is where we part, thank you for watching this far. I really appreciate you, and I hope I'll see you next time. Bye.